Have you ever wondered why you don't float off into space? This curiosity leads us to the concept of gravity, an unseen yet crucial force that keeps us grounded on Earth. It's the invisible hand that holds everything in place, from the smallest grain of sand to the largest mountain. It's the silent player in our daily lives, making ordinary tasks possible. It's more than just a force, it's a fundamental part of our existence. Gravity, an invisible force, has a remarkable hold on us and everything around us. Imagine water flowing uphill, defying the very essence of gravity. Sounds like a fantasy, right? But in some parts of our planet, this seemingly impossible phenomenon becomes a reality. Take the magnetic hill in India, for instance, a place where the laws of physics appear to bend. Here, vehicles left in neutral gear start moving uphill on their own, and water also seems to flow against gravity. But is it really what it appears to be? Or is there something else at work? The answer lies in the world of optical illusions. You see, our brains are incredible at interpreting the world around us. But sometimes they can be tricked. In the case of the magnetic hill, the surrounding landscape creates an optical illusion that makes a slight downhill slope appear to be an uphill slope. The layout of the land, the horizon, and the way the road is positioned all combine to create a convincing illusion. As a result, when you see water flowing uphill or cars climbing the slope without any propulsion, it's not gravity taking a break. It's your brain being fooled by the cleverly deceptive landscape. This phenomenon isn't unique to India. Other places around the world, like the Mystery Spot in California or the Magnetic Hill in Canada, also showcase this gravity-defying illusion. Each location has its unique set of factors that create the perfect conditions for this fascinating trickery of perception. So the next time you hear about water flowing uphill or cars moving on their own, remember, it's not a supernatural occurrence or a defiance of physics. It's a testament to the power of perspective and the brain's interpretation of the world around us. And while these places may seem like they're breaking the laws of nature, they're simply playing by a different set of rules, the rules of optical illusions. So even though it seems like gravity has taken a day off, it's still very much at work. Ever heard of a tower that leans but never falls? Our journey today takes us to the heart of Italy, where the leaning tower of Pisa has been defying the laws of gravity for over eight centuries. Erected in the 12th century, the tower started leaning soon after construction began due to the soft soil it was built on. Yet, it's still standing today, a testament to both human engineering and the mysterious force of gravity. Gravity, you see, is the invisible force that pulls objects towards each other. It's what keeps us grounded and it's what's keeping the leaning tower of Pisa from toppling over. The tower leans at an angle of about 4 degrees. This means the top of the tower is displaced horizontally about 12 feet from where it would be if the structure were perfectly vertical. But why hasn't it fallen? Well, it's all about the tower's center of gravity, the average location of the weight of an object. Even though the tower is leaning, its center of gravity still falls within its base, creating an equilibrium that prevents it from toppling over. Over the years, the tower's lean has increased, causing concern. However, restoration work has reversed some of the tilt. Engineers removed soil from under the raised end, causing the tower to sink back towards vertical. This process, known as soil extraction, reduced the lean by about 17 inches. This careful manipulation ensures that the tower's center of gravity remains within its base. But that's not all. The tower's heavy masonry, weighing about 14,500 tons, also helps it stay grounded. The weight of the stone pushes down, compressing the soil beneath it, creating a balance that works in harmony with gravity. So, although the leaning tower of Pisa may look like it's defying gravity, it's actually working with it. The tower leans, yes, but gravity, that invisible, unyielding force, keeps it from falling. Despite its precarious lean, gravity keeps the Tower of Pisa firmly anchored to the ground. Stones usually sink, right? But what if I told you there are stones that float? Welcome to an extraordinary part of the world, the Ramsethu, located in India, where stones seem to defy the laws of gravity. This phenomenon, as baffling as it may seem, has a scientific explanation. But before we delve into that, let's understand what exactly we're dealing with. The Ramsethu is an ancient bridge-like structure, also known as Adam's Bridge. It's made up of a chain of limestone shoals, stretching for over 48 kilometers. This bridge is steeped in mythology, but what's truly fascinating is that some of the stones in this bridge appear to float on water. Now you might be wondering, how is that possible? 
After all, stones are denser than water and as per the laws of physics, they should sink. But here's where things get interesting. The stones of Ramsethu are not your typical terrestrial rocks. They are pumice stones. Pumice, unlike most rocks, is created when volcanic lava cools rapidly. This rapid cooling traps air bubbles within the rock, giving it a porous structure. These tiny air pockets make the stone lighter, and when the stone's overall density becomes less than that of water, it floats. Yet it's not just about the stone's unique composition. The region's water density also plays a part. The seawater around Ramsethu is brackish, meaning it's a mix of salt and fresh water. This increases the water's density, further aiding the stone's buoyancy. So while it may seem like a magical event, the floating stones of Ramsethu are a testament to the marvels of geology and physics. It's a perfect example of how nature, with its unique creations, can give the illusion of defying the laws of gravity. Gravity might pull things down but sometimes nature has its own way of bending the rules. So next time you see a stone, remember, not all stones sink. Some in the right conditions can float, challenging our understanding of the world around us. Can a car roll uphill by itself? On gravity hills it seems to. Welcome to the peculiar world of gravity hills, places where the usual rules of gravity seem to be turned on their head. You'll find these fascinating spots scattered across the globe, each one a local marvel, where parked cars appear to roll uphill and cyclists struggle to ride downhill. It's a sight that defies logic and leaves onlookers scratching their heads in bewilderment. Now, before you start packing your bags to witness this defiance of gravity, let's delve into the science behind this mysterious phenomenon. In reality, the uphill movement is nothing more than an optical illusion, a trick played by the unique layout of the surrounding landscape. Imagine a road or a slope, surrounded by a landscape that slopes in an opposite direction. The contrasting angles create a visual distortion, which our brains interpret as an uphill slope. This is despite the fact that the so-called gravity hill is actually sloping downhill. As a result, when a car is placed in neutral on this deceptive incline, it appears to roll uphill, seemingly defying gravity. This illusion is so convincing that it's not only cars that seem to be affected. Water, when poured onto the surface, appears to flow uphill, and balls, when placed on the ground, roll upward as if pulled by an invisible force. Gravity hills are a perfect example of how our brains process information about the world around us. They demonstrate the power of perspective and the role it plays in shaping our understanding of reality. So while you won't find any real gravity-defying wonders on these hills, they do offer an intriguing glimpse into the complexities of human perception. They serve as a reminder that things aren't always as they appear, and sometimes, what we perceive can be a far cry from reality. Gravity hills are a testament to how our perception of gravity can be tricked. From floating stones to water flowing uphill, the wonders of our world never cease to amaze. Our journey began with the invisible force that holds everything together, gravity. It's omnipresent, yet its effects are anything but ordinary. The way it shapes water, for instance, can be utterly magical. We've seen how water can appear to defy gravity, climbing up walls and flowing uphill, a spectacle that challenges our everyday understanding of the natural world. Then we journeyed to the Leaning Tower, a mystery that has puzzled scholars and tourists alike for centuries. This architectural marvel seems to defy the laws of gravity, standing tall despite its precarious tilt. The force of gravity, ever-present, is what gives this tower its unique charm and allure. We then moved on to the Floating Stones, another gravity-defying marvel. These stones, despite their weight, seem to float effortlessly in the air, a phenomenon that again challenges our understanding of gravity. Our final stop was the Gravity Hill Illusion, where cars appear to roll uphill, and water seems to flow the wrong way. It's a clear demonstration of how gravity can play tricks on our perception, making the impossible seem possible. These gravity-defying wonders truly remind us of the fascinating and complex world we inhabit, all held together by the incredible force of gravity. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more.